Well, back here locally, the Cultural Arts Alliance of Walton County is finding ways to provide relief and involvement opportunities during the pandemic. And that's what Mackenzie McClintock is tracking this morning for us. Hey there, Mackenzie. Hey, good morning, Erin. That is exactly right. Welcome into Justin Gaffrey's studio, everybody. We're learning more about that Art On Demand online series. And he's also doing some painting for us this morning. First of all, good morning, Justin. And tell us what you're working on. Good morning. I am working on a commission of a poppy painting. It's a kind of a remake of a painting that had been recently sold, or sold actually a long time ago. Okay, very cool. We want to talk about that Art On Demand series, which is a virtual online event that the Cultural Arts Alliance is holding. It showcases artists like yourself, and for this one that's coming up in a week, you're talking about the new paint company you've started. So fill us in. So I've been wanting to make paint for years because nobody was able to make the paint the way I wanted to make paint. So finally I decided to make it myself. And since that process, I had to learn chemistry and manufacturing. And so it's been a really interesting journey trying to learn both chemistry and manufacturing at the same time. It's been a, an extreme learning curve. Right. And then as we also talk a little bit about the painting that you're working on here, we can talk about the opportunity that it is to, to have this Art on Demand series and what it's doing for local artists like yourself. So as you know, as I mentioned before, the pandemic, I think, hits, hits a lot of communities hard, restaurant business and artists and everything. So this is a great opportunity for us to show our works. Yeah, love that. And of course, it's free for viewers at home to see. They can see it online. And if there's anything else you would like to say right now about that Coastal Makers episode that, again, is coming up one week from today, let people know exactly how to tune in and really what they're going to see from you. Well, I'm just really excited about this stuff right here. This is the paint that I just learned how to make. Well, I've been learning over the past few years, but I've just finally mastered this paint. And this is one of the most excited things I've done in my life was manufacturing this perfectly textured paint here. Yeah. with nice heavy pigments and <laughs> just really excited about this paint. Love it. And of course, everybody at home can, can see that. And really, they're getting to do at home what we're getting to do today, which is see the cameras come inside the studio and check it out. So we appreciate you being with us today. And we're going to continue to be live here from the studio this morning to tell everybody about that, as well as the emergency relief fund that's available for Walton County artists. Still ongoing right now. You can get a grant from that. We will have those details coming up in the 6 o'clock hour. So stick with us for that information. As far as Lauren Hope in the studio, she's filling us in on the info for the weather today. Good morning. Good morning. And hey.